Imagine you're playing a guessing game where you choose between two doors and a friend reveals what was behind one of the doors after you've already made your choice. But what if their reveal could somehow change your past decision? This idea may sound like science fiction, but it's a simplified way to think about the delayed choice quantum eraser experiment, a fascinating test in quantum physics that challenges our understanding of time and reality. At its core, the experiment builds on the famous double slit experiment, where light or particles are sent through two slits and create an interference pattern, behaving like waves. However, when scientists observe which slit the particle goes through, the interference pattern disappears and the particles behave like tiny bullets instead of waves. This means the act of measuring changes the outcome. The delayed choice quantum eraser takes this a step further. In this experiment, the decision to measure which slit a particle went through can be made after the particle has already passed through the slits. Incredibly, it appears that this late decision can retroactively determine whether the particle acted like a wave or a particle in the past. Um, to make this more relatable, think of it like recording a football game without watching it live. You avoid any spoilers and only check the score after watching the full recording. But in this strange quantum reality, your choice to check the score at the end could somehow change what actually happened during the game itself. In the actual experiment, light particles, photons, are split into pairs. One photon is sent towards a detector to create an interference pattern, while the other is sent down a different path where scientists can choose to measure it. If they measure it, the interference disappears. If they don't, the pattern remains. The twist is that this measurement choice happens after the first photon has already hit the detector, <laughs> suggesting that the past is somehow being influenced by future actions. Scientists are still grappling with what this means. Some interpretations suggest that time in the quantum world doesn't work the way we perceive it in our everyday lives, and cause and effect relationships might not be as fixed as we assume. The delayed choice quantum eraser experiment raises profound questions. Is reality truly objective or does our observation shape it? Does the universe know when it's being watched? These ideas challenge our understanding of time and suggest that the nature of reality might be more interconnected and mysterious than we ever imagined. The delayed choice quantum eraser experiment presents one of the most profound challenges to our understanding of time and reality. Imagine watching a movie where you decide the ending halfway through and, inexplicably, your choice changes everything that happened earlier. This concept mirrors the experiment's implications, which suggest that decisions made after an event can influence its past outcome. Classical physics adheres to a strict cause and effect order, but in the quantum world, this rule breaks down, raising the possibility that past and future might be linked in a deeper, hidden reality. In 1999, physicists conducted a version of this experiment and found that photons particles of light, appeared to know whether they were being observed even after they had already passed through the experimental setup. It's like drawing a card from a deck and discovering later that the card has somehow changed based on whether someone decided to look at it afterward, a paradox that continues to puzzle scientists. To grasp the delayed choice quantum eraser, we must first explore the famous double slit experiment which unveiled the dual nature of particles. When electrons or photons are fired at a barrier with two slits, they create an interference pattern on the screen behind, suggesting they behave like waves, passing through both slits simultaneously. However, the moment we observe which slit the particle travels through, the interference disappears and they behave like solid particles. The act of measurement appears to change their nature, as if they know they are being watched, but what if the decision to observe them is made after they have already traveled through the slits? This delayed observation adds another layer of mystery. In countless experiments, electrons have displayed wave-like properties when unobserved but switched to particle-like behavior when a detector was introduced. It's like walking down a hallway with two doors, only to have your past path mysteriously altered when someone watches a security recording. In the delayed choice quantum eraser experiment, a pair of entangled photons, light particles with a mysterious link, are used to test the boundaries of reality. One photon called the signal photon 
heads directly to a detector, while its entangled twin, the idler photon, takes a longer, more complex path through beam splitters and mirrors before it is measured. If scientists choose to measure the idler photon's path after the signal photon has already been recorded, it retroactively determines whether the signal photon exhibited wave-like or particle-like behavior. This suggests that time at the quantum level does not behave the way we experience it in everyday life. In real-world experiments, precise timing ensures that the idler photon is measured much later, yet it still appears to influence the behavior of the signal photon. It's like writing a story where a friend chooses the ending later and suddenly earlier chapters adjust themselves to fit the new conclusion. A key component of this experiment is quantum entanglement, a phenomenon where two particles share an instantaneous connection no matter how far apart they are. This mysterious link allows one photon's behavior to influence its twin in ways that seem to defy classical logic. In the delayed choice experiment, entanglement allows one photon's measurement to affect its partner, even though it should have already made a decision about its behavior. This suggests that quantum entanglement could bypass our conventional understanding of space and time, acting instantaneously across vast distances. Quantum entanglement is already being harnessed for secure communication technologies, where any attempt to intercept information disrupts the entire system. It's like having two identical twins who can sense each other's emotions instantly, even when separated by thousands of miles. The implications of the delayed choice experiment challenge our conventional understanding of time and causality. Traditionally, time is seen as a one-way street, first breakfast, then lunch, then dinner. But this experiment suggests that the future might influence the past, raising the possibility that time is an illusion and all moments exist simultaneously waiting to be revealed through observation. Some physicists propose the idea of retro-causality, where future decisions can shape past events, fundamentally changing how we perceive reality. This notion challenges the linear experience of time, making it seem as if deciding today to study for a test could somehow allow you to have already known the answers yesterday. One of the most astonishing implications of quantum mechanics is the role of the observer. Does reality exist in a fixed state when no one is looking? The delayed choice experiment suggests that observation is not merely passive, but actively shapes the outcome of events. According to the Copenhagen interpretation of quantum mechanics, particles exist in all possible states simultaneously until an observation forces them into a single reality. If taken to the extreme, this idea suggests that consciousness itself might play a fundamental role in shaping the universe. Just like in a video game where the world only loads when you turn to look at it, reality may exist in potential form until we observe it collapsing into something definite. Physicists have proposed several interpretations to explain the strange findings of the delayed choice experiment. The many worlds interpretation suggests that all possible outcomes exist in parallel universes, meaning every choice creates a new reality. On the other hand, the Copenhagen interpretation maintains that reality collapses into a single outcome upon... These competing views offer drastically different perspectives on the nature of existence, whether we live in a single deterministic universe or an ever-branching multiverse. The many worlds theory, for instance, suggests that every time we make a choice, a separate version of reality is created, leading to infinite possibilities. It's like a book where every decision branches into a new storyline, and all versions exist simultaneously. Conducting quantum experiments such as the delayed choice quantum eraser requires cutting edge technology and extreme precision. Scientists must measure events occurring at unimaginably small scales and time scales. Despite these challenges, advancements in quantum technology are opening new possibilities in computing, communication, and fundamental physics. Quantum computers, for example, exploit the principles of superposition and entanglement to perform calculations that are impossible for classical computers. The development of these technologies is akin to transitioning from a slow dial-up internet connection to an instantaneous, ultra-fast communication network. The delayed choice quantum eraser experiment ultimately challenges everything we believe about the nature of reality. It suggests that time, space, and observation are intertwined in ways that remain beyond our full comprehension. 
Whether reality exists independently of observation or is shaped by it remains an open question in modern science. Ongoing experiments continue to investigate whether reality is deterministic or influenced by observation, pushing the boundaries of our understanding. It's like gazing at a painting that shifts every time you look at it from a new perspective, reminding us that reality might be far more flexible and mysterious than it seems.